you know, life is about being true. If you lie to yourself and it happens a lot, um, then you will have a life of dreams, but the dreams will never come true. Unless you realize the truth. And this, this is what David is following. And so I trusted him and followed him. Hi there. I am Yunus Rashid and I am in the customer support and I'm also 28 years old. I was uh, skipping around in the TikTok videos. I was thinking, wow, that's, uh, this, uh, this guy, he, has, uh, he knows what he is talking about. So I was more and more interested and I became more and more interested as I uh, wanted to have a girlfriend and I was failing on it and I didn't know how to go on a date. I didn't know how to, to, to be more myself. At first I thought, okay, there's a guy talking about dating, probably just a usual dating expert who actually is just just wants your money or uh, the money of other people and then he was talking about things that i already know about and which are already true so i became more and more interested and i thought okay this guy maybe is not that that normal of a guy he is he's not really just interested in your money he's more interested in success and he knows what he's talking about it was, or these thoughts um, came up into my mind. Bad as hell. It was bad as hell. I mean, like, I don't know. I totally wasn't myself and I didn't feel that cool as I actually wanted to be. In, as I was, um, when I was single, I felt cool. Then I got a girlfriend. I still thought about myself. I'm cool until um, until some time. I well, I didn't realize, but I felt that I went from cool to less cool. And after breaking up, it was totally. I I uh, realized what was wrong, and. Um, I tried to, to be more open to girls, to women, and I was flirting around here and there, but somehow, I don't know, somehow I didn't really felt it. I still felt unexperienced, not unexperienced, but more un... Um, I, I had the thought that I'm not really, I don't have really enough knowledge, something I felt missing. Fear, fear. I had a lot of fears, especially about what they think about me. I tried to be as good as they wanted me to be. Um, I tried to, to fulfill their, um, their imagination of myself. So they saw me as someone else as I'm actually am. And I tried to fulfill this dream, but um, I couldn't. I couldn't because I'm not the person that they think of me. So I uh, was afraid if they realize that I'm someone else, uh, another person um, from the different person, which is in their mind, then I, I was afraid that this will never be a good relationship or it will never be a good dating life or it will never be a good conversation. And um, I always wanted to tell them, wow, I'm, I'm really good, I'm the best, I'm this and this and all those kinds, these kinds of things I'm not. I'm just who I am and I was afraid to express myself because I was thinking that the way I am is, in their mind, bad. So I was afraid of it. Because I believed in David's uh, coaching. That's 
I knew he, he said some, he, he said things that are just true. And, you know, life is about being true. If you lie to yourself and it happens a lot, um, then you will have a life of dreams, but the dreams will never come true. Unless you realize the truth. And this, this is what David is following. And so I trusted him and followed him. A lot of things I learned that was really cool. And the way that David also um, coached or taught me was easy. It was easy to understand. At least for me, I don't know. Um, and, and he was also always uh, open. He was always open. I had the uh, WhatsApp coaching with him. And he, he really quickly answered him. Um, he, was, he was really answered to me and... To every question I had, he was there for me. Once you went through the path that David coached you, you have the feeling you can date every gone woman. It doesn't matter if I should break up with the girl and or she should up break up with me. Um, and I want to date another girl. I know how to. I feel confident. So that is my girlfriend and that guy on the other side, who is pretty cool as well, is me. To be honest, easy peasy, seriously. No, I'm joking, I'm joking. To be his client is an honor, I tell you, it's an honor. Because, um, I mean, there are a lot of coaching people and a lot of are miserable. Are not miserable, but they are bad, they are terrible. And finding someone who loves the truth, who loves the love, it's it's like having a best friend on your side for a period of your time, for a little of period of your time, in exchange for some money, but it's okay, it's okay. And to me it's an honor to have known David because he's really cool, he's really cool. And I like coaching with him, with him. We laughed a lot together. And what I also like on his personality is um, he can, oh, well, at first I wasn't sure how to talk with him. But, but once you, you, you get, uh, well, in a period of short time, really short time, you really, it's like he isn't your coach. It's like he's your friend who's your co who's coaching you. It's really awesome. It's cool. That's co cool to have such of a kind and such of a um, honest and direct. The directly, I don't know direct. Um, if it's the correct word for English. It's really cool experience. It's really amazing experience. I like it. I like. I love it. And I I want to keep this memory until the end of my life. I want to say I had a really good friend or a really good coach. He, and um, I can say that he's one of the best coaches that there are on the internet. A lot of coaches, I didn't ask them whether he wanted to coach me or not. Be, it, it doesn't matter how desperate I am on, the, on, on David's side. I felt sure. I felt um, secure. It's, I'm I feel honored for being, um, I feel honored to be David's or to be able to be David's client and I'm grateful that I could find him on the TikTok video. If you are not an arrogant guy, okay, if you don't say, nah, this is what you say, David, is, is not true, I don't like it, I don't believe it, then you are wrong. It's Then don't go to David, you are just wasting your time and his time as well if you really want to date if you really want to know if you are how, how things work if you really want to try things out then it doesn't matter which personality you have go to him honestly i think it's a good price it's high well it, it really depends if you are a really poor guy or something um it's hard, it's hard, it's, but that's usual, that's normal. But if you have enough money and you want to invest 
the money um, for something good, then it's worth it.